great talents that have played in the NFL, only one has simply been known as the freak. At the five, touchdown, freak. That, of course, is Javon Curse. The original Titan Curse was a three-time Pro Bowl selection who totaled 74 sacks and 28 forced fumbles in an 11-year career that was especially spectacular from 1999 to 2003. Those were the five years where the Titans were especially spectacular in their own right, and now more than a decade into retirement, Curse watches the Titans play every week. Allen on third and ten. Being heated up, in trouble. Sack! Yes! Harold Landry! It's no surprise that Javon Curse has been very interested in Harold Landry. Because of Landry's great start to the season, Curse's Titans sack record of 14 and a half is in real trouble. But that's fine by Curse. He's a fan of number 58. The guy, he, he has a motor. And basically, like, that's, that, that's basically like how I play. Like, um, I had my skill set, I had speed, I had get off. But on top of that, I just, I was persistent. And that's what he does. Like, he comes, he brings it, he brings that intensity, like, all game. Javon Curse is most intrigued by Jeffrey Simmons. Simmons is a freak in his own right, and Curse believes that his gifts would make Big Jeff a big star in any era. It seems like when he wants to, when he makes his mind up, you can't stop him. He can be very disruptive, and that's what you want um, uh, with playing on a team with a guy like that. Especially if I was a DN, like I would love to line up next to this guy. Dude, go in there and, and mess things up so it, it can like it can help me out on the end over here. So he's one of those guys that can like he can change a game all by himself, and that's good. Now over 40, Curse is regularly seeing the sons of his NFL peers start to creep onto NFL rosters. Plus, a lot of guys that he played with and against are now coaching. Mike Vrabel qualifies on that list. Curse loves to watch Vrabel at work and would have loved to have played for him. He was on the Super Bowl team, like a, a dynasty. Got a lot of coaching success under his hands by playing with Bill Belichick. Now he's just putting what he did He's putting it to use, which as a player, it makes you like be more like accountable for that person because you've seen that person. This person won Super Bowls. This person did, he did, he, he did the walk. So now he's just not talking it. Like he, now he just wants to just pass it on. So someone like Mike Vrabel, it's, I see no other reason than to just go out there and get this guy all you have. I think the first time I saw him get out in the drill with some of the football players, whatever, like a coach that does that, like you gotta, you, like let's let's go, like let's go win this thing, baby. 